All right, we are in Prague at the showroom of Victoria Arino and Nova Simonelli. And in this video, we're gonna tell you how to choose a professional espresso machine for your coffee shop. So check it out. Buying an espresso machine is not an easy thing. It's one of the biggest and the most important investment one needs to make when opening or running the coffee shop. There is a wide range of machines and brands on the market that can easily confuse you. Since we have worked closely with Simonelli Group for many years, we took an advantage of their experience center here in Prague where we met with Miroslav Skuček to discuss all about choosing the right commercial espresso machine and many more. In this video, we'll go through six different espresso machines they have on display here. It's Victoria Arduino Black Eagle Maverick, Eagle One, Eagle One Prima, White Eagle, and from Nova Simonelli Aurelia Wave and Apia Life. As we'll look at these machines, we'll discuss some of the key criteria to consider. And that is price, design, quality of coffee to serve, variety of drinks on the menu, energy consumption, and also size and portability. Plus, at the end of this video, we'll discuss two very important aspects of buying an espresso machine, regular maintenance and water filtration system. Okay, so let's get into it. We'll start with the Black Eagle Maverick. It's a flagship espresso machine from Victoria Arduino, which means it has the latest features that the company offers at the moment. The design follows the Black Eagle product line. It's solid and robust, but this has a much lower profile. It's only 43 cm tall, which makes the position on a coffee bar less disruptive. Still, it's a heavy beast. 90 kilos for this two-group machine. It's a multi-boiler espresso machine. Steam boiler is 9 liters with high pressure of 2.2 bars and 0.75 liters for the coffee boiler. What's interesting here is that the heated water, before being dispensed, recirculates through the cold water, bringing energy back into the system. This and other energy saving features can cut the energy consumption down by 35%. Then, there are two more features that make the difference. Gravitec and Pew Brew. Gravitec allows for high precision brewing with inbuilt scales, so a barista can set up the espresso output in grams and can simply rely on the machine to deliver it. Together with temperature stability and precision, that's the key to extracting high quality single origin coffees consistently. Okay, right now we are tasting Pure Brew on Black Eagle Maverick. Pure Brew is a new patented cone shaped basket for about 20 grams of coffee. It allows for low pressure brewing that results in filter coffee like extraction. There is no tamping involved, just turn to the pure brew mode and let the coffee extract. A barista can easily use it for tea brewing too, which is often neglected even in specialty cafes, and this system can help to make a consistent recipe around it. Okay, Eagle One was designed to reflect the new needs of specialty coffee shops around the globe. It's smaller, subtle, with smarter technologies inside that reduces the environmental impact of making coffee. By design, it's made easy to customize, either with paint or removable foil, which makes Eagle One machines easy to fit into an interior space of any cafe. The steam boiler for this machine is 7 liters, but what's interesting is that the main water boiler contains just 0.14 liters of water. Think of the size of Red Bull can, and that's still enough to have a water in the right temperature to make delicious double espresso. That's what reduces the time to heat up the machine and overall energy consumption, which is increasingly important. Virtual Intelligent Scale is another new feature of Eagle One machines that help baristas to achieve a precise espresso weight output without any additional hardware, but only algorithmic calculation. Victoria Arduino White Eagle White Eagle is a parallel design line to Black Eagle that takes more traditional approach to design of the espresso machine when it comes to the size, design and energy consumption. It can be both single and multi-boiler machine with thermocontrol group heads. Five buttons on each group compared to three for Black Eagle. It has cool touch steam one and high or low position of group head. It's a popular value option for specialty cafes that wants to get the good stack and can fit more spacious and traditional looking espresso machine. Early in 2023, Eagle Tempo was introduced and it will most probably carry the philosophy of White Eagle further on. Eagle One Prima. Eagle One Prima is a small professional single group espresso machine that you can plumb in or use 1.5 liters water tank as a source. That's what makes this espresso machine versatile. It can be used at home, in the office spaces, but it's fully capable of running a small espresso bars, roastery labs or events. 
Still, it's a multi-boiler espresso machine that can achieve very precise temperature stability. You control it with three simple buttons to set doses, temperatures or cleaning. You get into more detailed setting through a mobile app that allows you to browse through a library of recipes from coffee roasters around the globe. Okay, so now we are tasting the espresso from Victoria Arvino Prima. The design of Prima follows the aesthetics of Eagle One. It's simple, elegant and clean shapes, easy to customize to fit the interior. We hope to have one, this one, in the office at some point. Early this year, two new models of Prima were launched. EXP model with a pure brew technology and also Pro model with T3 technology and new brew head with touchscreen control panel. Aurelia Wave. Aurelia Wave is designed for high volume, small or bigger coffee chains or stores that aims for optimized workflow, same design and same setting of the machine with improved energy efficiency. It comes with a multiple model with the same look but different technology inside. The model we see is Aurelia Wave UX. That is a single boil machine with 14 liters capacity but an electric heating on the group head. It receives the same water temperature input of 89 degrees Celsius and then heat it up to the preset temperature output. It's a hybrid way to achieve a solid temperature stability even with a single boiler technology. As we discussed with Mirek, the implementation of Easy Cream on Aurelia is one of the best due to the positioning of the Steam One within the machine. Just recently at Host Milano 2023, new model called Nuova Aurelia was announced that we'll see on the bar starting from the next year. Appia Live. Appia Live is the most popular and the most selling small but heavy duty espresso machine from Simonelli Group. It's a good choice for basic offering of espresso based drinks in a small cafes, restaurants, but also for caterings, events or farm and market. Since it's a single boiler machine, it will work great with blends or more developed coffees where temperature control is not that crucial to have a great tasting espresso in the cup. You can pick a regular or smaller compact version with a smaller boiler of 7 liters. The machine with the grinder occupies the same space as the regular model itself, which is very convenient for small spaces and events. You can pick between high or low group position to optimize for regular or takeaway service. A great thing is that the machine is relatively simple, so many technicians or even skilled baristas can handle a regular maintenance and some repairs. Okay, now that we saw all the espresso machines in the detail, whether you have your favorite or not, it doesn't matter because these two things are very important to prolong your investment into any espresso machine. Number one, regular maintenance and number two, water filtration. We will start with the regular maintenance with two big questions. How much does it cost yearly and what could happen if you miss it? Each machine we saw has a yearly maintenance kit that includes all the parts that should be replaced and checked within one year of the operation. The cost of the parts is between 200 to 300 euros. There are some parts you can replace yourself like brew baskets, shower screens, group head gaskets. But most actions inside the machine requires a qualified service person. So there is an additional fee to that. These are parts like pressure valves, seals and sprays that allows for espresso machine to operate properly. If you miss the regular maintenance, the most common issues you will experience is steam leakage and possible water dripping and also loss of extraction pressure and power, which results in inconsistent dosing, those worse espresso shots. Second important topic is water filtration system that affects the longevity of the machine and also flavor of extracted coffee. When you look at the system, first part typically consists of water pressure reducing valve that will control the input pressure to the machine and requirement is between 2 to 4 bars. Lower pressure is not a big issue, but high pressure could damage the pump. Then there is a 100 microns filter that causes all the solid parts. It prevents all the tiny nozzle within espresso machine from being damaged. Good thing is that it's one-time investment. You only remove and clean the filter every 6 to 12 months. The second part consists of various water filters and softeners that protect machine against limescale deposits of flavor components and chlorine. Here the specific setting and combination of cartridges depends on the water quality at the location. Most water filtration brands offer enough option for both protecting the machine and improving the taste of brewed coffee. The solution can be very simple, using a simple cartridge, or more complicated, going as far as for reverse osmosis solution. This is a repeated cost that you need to budget on a yearly basis. 
in this basic form as you see it here it's 400 to 500 euros per year thank you for showing us around it was a pleasure to see all the espresso machine i'm now thinking which will be the best one for our studio <laughs> it was a pleasure to me perfect thank you bye bye, bye, -bye. <laughs>